Early this morning, three people fled Lincoln County Sheriff deputies. Two of those folks are still at large. The pursuit started at around 1 a.m. after a patrol deputy located three suspicious individuals at a storage unit just north of Merrill. Those people all fled when the officer attempted to make contact. The deputy pursued one of the vehicles and informed responding deputies about the other two, which resulted in another separate pursuit. Both pursuits, though, ended in Merrill, where the suspects fled on foot. A 36-year-old Merrill man was found and arrested, but the other two suspects remain at large, and law enforcement are still looking for them. If you're interested in deer management, the public can tune in to meetings tonight on that topic. Earlier this week, County Deer Advisory Councils, or CDAC, began a two-week period of preliminary meetings to establish harvest goals, tag availability, and other seasonal details. Each county has their own CDAC, and coming up this evening, both the Oneida and Lincoln County CDACs will meet. The Oneida County meeting is at 6.30 p.m., Lincoln County, 7 p.m. Both meetings will be held remotely. Those meetings can be accessed on the DNR CDAC website, and you select the proper county. The next step will be a public comment period in April. Governor Evers announced today the newest community-based vaccination clinic will be in Wausau. This footage is from the former, vac former vaccination site in Green Bay, but this new WASA site will be at the North Central Technical College Center for Business and Industry Building. Initially, the clinic plans to administer at least 400 doses per day and has the ability to do up to 1,000 doses per day. The clinic will first schedule vaccinations for those on the Marathon County Health Department's wait list. The clinic will be open Tuesday through Saturday from 11 a.m. to 7 p.m. 500 pre-pack food boxes will be given away tomorrow at the Wausau Salvation Army. The food is for Marathon County residents who are in need. The boxes will include meat, dairy, and produce. There are no income requirements or restrictions other than one box per household. The giveaway is from 2 p.m. to 6 p.m.